you, <laughs> you're making the point at 51 that you can't carry on. At some point, um, our evolutionary reality will catch up with us and giving up the agricultural uh, diet and being more active are going to be very important parts of you having any chance of reaching an aging plateau. Exactly. I mean, natural selection, building adaptations, is what gives us our health. Mm. I've been saying that over and over again. And unfortunately, Hamilton's forces of natural selection scale that process of adaptation. Over the last, you know, five to 20,000 years, even for Eurasian populations, we've been conducting an, an evolutionary experiment on ourselves where we've been selecting for adaptation to agricultural conditions. This selection is very powerful at young ages and it fades out at later ages. All of this work suggests as you get older, you have to turn away from the milkshakes, you have to turn away from the breads, the pasta, the whole gamut of foods derived from grasses and the milk of other mammalian species, and you have to go back in evolutionary time. You go forward in chronological time, you go backward in evolutionary time, and I'm afraid that's the hard and fast deal. The utopian scenario where I can abuse my body any way I like, drink beer every day, and then take the magic pills, I think that's not going to happen. 